paint goes on the brush, but emotions are left on the canvas. There's like a light at the end of the tunnel and I can see it. 17-year-old Haley Thompson couldn't always see the light. Her sophomore year in high school, she was diagnosed with severe depression. But even before that, Haley cut herself, even ending up in the hospital. And ever since then, I never wanted to go back. She found her way to Beth Smith, an artist and art therapy instructor. I related a lot to Haley when she first started coming to me. Beth and Haley had both faced bullying in middle and high school. I saw a lot of what she was suffering with, with the bullying and, and rejection. I saw a lot of that same with what with my journey and my walk. Beth says a lot of her students bring heavy emotional burdens with them. They need someone to to show them love, show them understanding and help them realize that they are a unique individual that has a place in this world and they have a lot to offer creatively. And through art, they can use their feelings for something constructive. Art therapy is when you're able to harness ideas and emotions that are in here and you translate it through these onto a canvas or some type of creative medium. Working with Beth, Haley saw that she had talent, but showing what she felt inside wasn't easy. Well, I was kind of scared at first and like, Scared of what people say is like, oh my gosh, that's too dark. With encouragement, Haley yeah. created a piece she calls the monster within. It's not puppies and ponies. It's not a it's it's not a beautiful landscape. It is something that's raw that comes from in here. And when she showed it to people, something amazing happened. They could relate. This one guy he said the words were dark, but the monster was beautiful. And putting it on a canvas took some of the darkness away. She realized her art could bring peace. It's like you're taking a deep breath and all this stress and all this stuff that's on your mind, just letting it go. And her art could bring peace to others. I was very proud of myself of painting it, knowing that I helped other people in need. In the almost two years she's been helping Haley, Beth has seen her change. She's more confident. She's more confident in her abilities with her art. Um, emotionally, I see her more settled. Um, she, I've seen her uh, draw closer to God. Haley's current piece is about something different. If you love somebody, don't ever let them go. Though her battle isn't over, she hopes to share what she's learned. <laughs> it's okay to be depressed and it's okay to cry, and, uh, but it's not okay to hurt yourself. And she hopes to inspire others. Being afraid will hold you back, so don't be afraid.